hi my name is Vishal in this video let's have a look on the blend node in the substance designer so right now uh, I just got any uh, default uh, substance designer scene so firstly I would like to create a new uh, substance uh, designer graph there and then create metallic roughness and then just leave it like that so here uh, firstly uh, in atomic nodes you have this node called blend we can grab that what is a blend is it will mix two different uh, inputs or images uh, one is the foreground another one is the background it will mix two different two uh, images here uh, and uh, also it will blend between the two images mixing blending are two different things and how it happens I'll show you so what I will do is I'll create two different textures one uh, is uh, maybe a cells and another would be clouds now if you see I'll connect the cells in the background and clouds in the foreground and then you're seeing here um, the clouds because clouds is in foreground and uh, cells is in the background uh, but if you want cells in the background and clouds in the back foreground then you should swap the connections like that but again uh, it is not easy to always delete the connections and connect instead select the wires and press X on the keyboard then it will swap now you should able to see clouds is swapped by the cells there and cells is swapped by the clouds just I'm pressing X on the keyboard now if I select the blend node we have opacity where you are able to see that I'm controlling the amount of cells on top of the clouds there this is what I'm talking about which is called mix okay now what is uh, another thing you could do here is I think the, the cells So if you see here I've got uh, these two things now I just go to the patterns here and then choose a uh, star pattern here now this is a black and white image which works as the I just take this wire and then connect it here and you should able to see uh, the f the fur texture is in the background okay and uh, the clouds is on the foreground and the foreground is masked by this image which has been connected into the opacity attribute here and opacity still works uh, as a slider there so I was talking about the blending mode so blending mode works here we have add blending mode we have subtract blending mode we have multiply add subtract max lighten min darken switch divide overlay screen soft light so default it is copy blend node is widely used in substance designer to create most of the textures texture patterns it is a, a very useful node I can say uh, we have this nice option here called cropping which will crop the texture from the sides if you see we have cropping area we have the left side we have the right side we have the top side we have the bottom side okay 